Inertia, the tendency to keep moving the way you are already moving. For example, Feature in motion will stay in motion unless acted upon by a force. Hi guys, welcome to another edition of Ringler Science. Hey! hey! Coming to you from my science basement. Today, we're talking Newton's first law of motion, also known as the law of inertia. Every year I get this same question. Mr. Ringler, why is it that when I'm sitting in the back seat of my mother's car and, and she suddenly turns, why do I go flying into the side of the car? <laughs> you don't go flying into the side of the car. The side of the car comes flying into you. You see, you have a car and a student, and they are traveling down the road together. And all of a sudden, the car turns, but the student wants to keep going where they were going. And the student goes splat into the car window as the car takes them away. Newton's first law of motion states that an object at rest will stay at rest, and an object in motion will stay in motion unless acted upon by a force. Now the first part is easy. It simply means that an object at rest, like my Rubik's Cube, it is at rest. And it's gonna stay at rest unless some force moves it. So let's do a inertia demonstration. I have here a crown. It's my Newton's crown. So I'm going to put my Newton's crown on my head, right? And we remember, an object in motion will stay in motion, right? Unless acted upon by a force. And an object at rest will stay at rest. unless acted upon by a force. Ugh. On this demonstration, I'll need a beaker of water, a pie plate, a cardboard tube, and an egg. Now this egg is gonna be a little bit like Wile E. Coyote in the Roadrunner cartoon, where he runs off the cliff and then he holds in midair for a second and then gravity catches hold and he falls down. So, pie plate, cardboard tube, and the egg. Now, I'm going to hit the pie plate out. And for just a moment, the egg's inertia, its desire to stay at rest, is going to hold the egg up in midair before it is pulled down into the beaker. Let's see. Ready? Three, two, one. Now let's slow it down, super slow-mo, and see if we could see the egg hanging up there in midair. Well, and that's all for today's episode of Ringler Science. Hey! Hey! Brrrr.